Marriage couples now legally allowed to marry here in Michigan and all across the country after last week's historic Supreme Court ruling. But that is not stopping the debate among conservatives in Lansing. And now there's a new push for laws that would limit the expansion of gay rights in our state. Fox News, Tim Skubik explains. Despite all the jubilation in the gay community last week over the high court ruling on gay marriage, the issue is still alive in the Michigan legislature. In fact, this pro-LGBT Democrat sees conservative Republicans trying to take the edge off of that high court decision. I think that's right. I think that's what we're hearing already from our colleagues, so I wouldn't be surprised to see something popping up very quickly. This Republican senator is on a mission to, as he puts it, protect everybody. I'm praying to protect everybody. Every single person in Michigan who has strong religious, closely held religious beliefs needs to be protected. You're not going to take this decision lying down. Uh, I think the states now have the uh, responsibility to step in and make sure they're protecting their citizens. On another front, under the Supreme Court decision, the state's civil rights law now protects newly married couples, but it is still legal to fire anybody who is gay. And so to say that under Michigan law now today, you have a legal right to be married to your same-sex partner, but you can then be fired from your job for announcing your marriage or be denied housing for announcing your marriage, that's a real problem. It's something we need to address in this state very soon. But what about the rights of those who oppose gays and have religious beliefs, this senator wonders. What does it do to the average business person that says, you know, I don't want to provide some sort of wedding reception for a gay wedding. I don't want to change the law that's going to harm that businessman or woman that simply wants to follow their religion. The Senate Democratic leader is hoping Republicans won't stand in the way of gay rights. Do you think for a second conservative Republicans are going to do that? Well, you know, I can always hope. You know. <laughs> well, hope springs eternal, but the reality is there's no votes for that. Probably not, unfortunately. I hope that constituents across the state call their, call their uh, senators and tell them to put, a, put aside this hatred and, and uh, move towards making everyone equal in Michigan. Bottom line, the battle over gay rights, despite that high court decision, is very much in play in this town. In Lansing, Tim Skubik, Fox 2 News.